Welcome back to Jibber Jab Reviews, and whether this is your first time here or you're a regular viewer, thanks for joining me and supporting my channel. In today's show, I review four new watch faces from AP Watches. Now this developer already has an extensive lineup of nicely designed faces and in a variety of different styles and layouts, so I'm really excited to show you his newest creations today. And I'm also going to be giving away a free coupon code for one of these watch faces, so make sure you stick around till the end of the review for the full contest details. Okay, let's go check out these brand new faces from AP Watches. Okay, first up is a hybrid watch face that has a clean layout and all that activity information is spaced out nicely to fill out those various cutout sections of the face. Now you have the full date shown below, your battery remaining, calories burnt, and step count are all on the left hand side, and your heart rate, floors climbed, and distance traveled are all located on the right hand side of the watch face. A bright red second hand circles the face and it contrasts nicely against this white and black color theme. Now, this is a classy looking face that gives you a good amount of information and the added flexibility of seeing both the digital and analog times. Next up is an all digital face and this one's very easy to read as it has larger digits for the time and I really like how the developer included the dials and other sections into the layout. Now you have a step counter, last recorded heart rate, seconds indicator and your battery status are all shown on the right hand side and in the sections on the left you have your floors climbed, distance moved, calories burnt as well as the full date. This one also comes equipped with seven app shortcuts with six being fixed and one is customizable, meaning you can assign any app you want to that location. It also comes with a handy notifications indicator area on the left hand side. Next up is another digital watch face and as you can see the layout of the display information is very different on this one. Instead of having those four dials down one side of the face, they're all evenly distributed along the top, the bottom, as well as the left and the right hand sides here. And that display information is the same that was included in the previous face and it even has the same app shortcuts, although as you can see they've been arranged in different locations for this model. So both of these faces offer a lot of features and functionality, it just comes down to which layout you prefer. And the last one I want to show you is another hybrid watch face that's sporty looking and again easy to read because of the oversized digits for the time at the bottom of the face. And even the hour hands are thick and chunky and this helps make it easier to read the analog time too because they contrast nicely against that all black background. Now all your activity information on this face is laid out in rows that line the top and center of the face starting with your floors climbed and distance moved at the top, step goal and heart rate underneath that and your step count and calories burnt are just above the time. A battery status dial sits in the center of the face and includes a graphical bar that shifts as the power depletes. And like all the other faces, this comes with app shortcuts including three customizable links as well as a colorful AOD mode. And if you want more information on the watch faces I reviewed today, then simply do a search in the Galaxy App Store under the name of these faces. The full details are also included in the video description. And I'm also going to be giving away a free coupon code for one of these, so if you want a chance to win, then all you have to do is to like this video and to leave a comment. At the end of the day, I'm going to randomly pick one winner from those who have commented, and I'll leave a reply under their comment to let them know exactly how they can get the code. So good luck to everyone, and get commenting! Okay, that's it for this episode. Thanks for watching and I would really appreciate it if you could share this video and to subscribe to my channel. It really helps me keep the channel going so I can continue to offer you guys discounts, giveaways, and fresh content. And if you want to be notified when the newest video is just released, then just click on that bell icon next to the subscribe button. I'll see you in the next episode. Until then, take care.